Jake, I mean, that's a tough loss. Um, we were quite far down at half time, but uh, almost clawed it back in the second half there, but just wasn't to be today. How are you feeling after that? Yeah, no, it was, uh, it, was a, it, was a, it was a tough loss, but you know we can't we can't argue with the boys' uh, determination and stuff out there. You know we 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 put up, wore our hearts on our sleeve for the full 80 minutes, um, and it was a slog. But you know we were expecting that coming up here. I don't think we'd lost. We uh, we we've won here since like 2017. Um, so you know we know it's a tough place to come. Um, but you know we've, we've got a lot of learnings out of that game. Um, so we just got to reflect on that next week and really uh, really go into Bath aware. Yeah, it was a slog. I mean, the conditions were awful. Do you think that had a bit of an effect on the game? Yeah, a bit. Um, you know, naturally, we like to play a high-tempo game. Uh, so, obviously, the dry the dry suits us. Um, but, you know, out there, especially first half, you know, it was just that one that one pass away. You know, we we built well, we set up well. Um, it was just that final pass didn't quite stick. Um, and then, you know, it's, we're back to square one. But, uh, as I said, the boys... The boys worked hard and we can't really ask more than that. And lastly, just on a personal note, your first uh, Buck Super Rugby appearance of the season, how nice was that? Yeah, no, it's always it's great to you know play Bucks. Um, haven't haven't quite had the opportunity this year as much. Um, but um, you know, every every time I you know play for Exeter, you know, it's a great it's a great feeling and it's a it's a great club to be a part of. Um, so yeah, just hope hopefully many more to come.